hello guys it's been kind of a stressful day today um i'm sure you probably have heard it's kind of national there was like guess mass threats for like school shootings and stuff and i didn't find out until this morning and i had already sent my kids to school and after my my daughter was on the bus she called she tells me that the bus driver mentioned something and then she gets to school and the school goes on lockdown because it's like a thread going all over. So she was obviously scared and she gets anxiety and stuff like that. So it hasn't been a good day for her, but luckily, and then she wanted me to go pick her up, but I told her, you know me, that lockdown means nobody in, nobody out. They won't let me in the school even if I try to call and call ahead or whatever. They it's lockdown. They won't let me go in the school. But I guess all these kids, the kids that went, because I guess a lot of people found out yesterday and they didn't send the kids to school. So she said there was like very little, which I thought it was strange this morning when I dropped them off. There's all usually like eight kids and there was only one boy and then my twins. But I didn't think nothing of it because I didn't, I had not heard about nothing about it. Um, but luckily I guess the kids were getting paranoid in school, afraid obviously that anybody would and they dismissed the kids from school early so my kids are on the way home now from with the school, the school, the school bus but it, it's crazy times we're living in and it's so sad but I'm seriously contemplating on looking for something to just keep them home because it, it, times are crazy already and then adding this type of things doesn't help, right? I like if you just I'm holding it in back, back. I feel like I'm gonna, I want to cry. I, I see them. I see them walking. So it should be here in a couple minutes. So I need to keep it together because she's already. My son is a little bit scared, but like he's he doesn't get anxiety, so it's not as bad for him. Which my daughter gets anxiety, so she gets really upset and nervous and freaks out, obviously. So they should be here, so I'm just gonna talk to you guys later. You know, try to keep it in, hold it in. Because if I break out, she's obviously gonna, I mean, if I break down, she's gonna break down, so. I just pray, a lot of prayers for this new generation. See you guys later. Hello guys, um, <clears throat> my daughter's doing much better, she's relaxed, she's home, so she's relaxed now. I'm ready because I, we have a, my husband has a work, um, dinner party, very casual, so I have a sweater, oh my god, I can't I'll give it one second now, I saw a sweater with a pearl design in it, jeans, black boots, Very simple. I'm just my makeup. So we are good, we're like almost getting ready to leave. So I might show you. I'm not sure because you know gotta respect other people's privacy. So who knows? So I'll see you guys later.
Good morning, guys. I'm getting ready to make the pancakes. Last night was um, it was pretty fun. Um, my husband is that he runs this company, and he has two of his brothers working for him, well, working for the company. And my two sons work. My one of my my oldest ones works part time in the afternoons because he has another job. And then my middle son, my second son. He works during the day, Monday through Friday. So we were all there, you know, it was nice to see all of them together. Um, we had a good time. After the dinner was over, my husband and I, and my sister-in-law and my brother-in-law, we headed to the casino. We were there for maybe an hour, not too long. I don't like spending, I don't like throwing away my money. I would take 20, 30 dollars out. I lose them, I lose them. We broke, we broke even. Day one, we broke even, but it was still a good time. So, uh, maybe I didn't record because I feel like we are recording on people if I didn't know. So, I like the respect. So, I, we did take some pictures, like girls. We all took some pictures. And um, at the dinner, and then we took some pictures, a, cute, a couple pictures at the casino. So I asked my sister, she doesn't mind, I'll post them here. And that's it. Now my day started pretty good. Yesterday, during the day, I, was, I must say though, yesterday during the day, it was a little bit hard. Let me start doing something with this, because I have to go. Let me move the camera. Yesterday during the day, it was a little hard for me. Uh, if you see me, I told you guys what happened. And anything I could, like, I could imagine with anybody, like anything. That involves like like my kids are around like danger, and they weren't around danger, but the threats alone got me like really worried. So, but my daughter was like, she came home, she was she settled down, she was okay, but she was really she was calling me, she was really scared. So I think nothing happened, but it was a scary situation, nevertheless. So. So this, I got the pancake mix, I'm sorry, I got the pancake mix, and I always, we always, oh, actually, water first, and then I put some chocolate chips. So I'll see you guys when I'm making the pancake. on the runner side and thicker side but sometimes when I make them thick they cook really good in the outside and they don't cook all the way in there <clears throat> so yeah I just wanted to say you know sorry for the ramble or all over the place this morning talking about a little bit of everything but Sometimes that's how life goes, right? Oh, I just, we just gotta put our best, give our best, you know. Look at my daughter, she's sitting on the couch. Um, yeah, we just gotta put our best face. Make everything, try to make everything, turn it into a positive thing. And learn from things, right? By the way, so you guys like my shirt? I got it last year. This. From Etsy last year. Um, also, want to show you one more thing. One more Grinch item. This is a special order, though. This is like um, from Etsy. No, I'm lying. I found this girl on Instagram. But I found through, I heard about her. From another YouTuber that I watch, her name is Paige Danielle, and she orders cups from here. So, and I 
and they're good quality they're kind of expensive but they're really good quality cups like she uses the cup that she uses is like i think what she say oh it doesn't say how many hours but i think it's like the 12 hour or 16 hours with cold and like eight hours with hot like it will stay hot for like up to that amount of hours and like they're like good quality cups and her work as you can see her work is awesome Grinch don't kill my vibe there's Max there's like the old side Max Grinch and Cindelou and this is like glow in the dark I'm just gonna show you her page just in case you guys are interested Mac Creations. I think it's called Mac Creations. So I think it's Mom and Daughter Creations. And I have water her. I mean, in between I order my kids, my myself. This is for me, my third. So I have a lemon one that I got in the summer. I have a Hocus Pocus mug that I order her. Then for my daughter's birthday this past summer, I had ordered her a uh, Harry Potter one because you know she has Harry Potter. And my daughter has ordered some, so we have ordered her, I don't know, about 10, 12 cups. They're a little bit inexpensive, but I like if they're gonna be good quality, I don't mind paying for it. And she always sends, I'll show you, she always sends like little extra things to be like, you know thankful that you guys are ordering for her and I'll show you I'm making a mess here so with the cup she sends you obviously a straw if you want to do that cold this is how the top look like looks like see you open it you could put you could slide the straw in there actually this is the you gotta put this inside the cup if you want to do it cold or if you want the hot. And she sends this as thank you things, that's like thank you gifts. Keychains with my letter. And they are really cute. And she also sends like straw toppers. You see, they're like you put the straw through there. It's like a Christmas tree. Yeah, she sent me a green one. She sent me a white one. They glittery, I don't know if you can tell on the camera. And she sent me two gnomes. They also straw toppers. And they are like the cutest things. So, if you guys are interested, you can look it up in her page and Instagrams. And she has the prices right there. She has different kinds of, she has different sizes of cups. That I got this tall skinny. So, but I have that in the biggest one, I have that in the medium one. I never got in a small one. But there's good quality. I'll show you my daughters in a minute. Sorry guys, I'm cooking and talking, showing you stuff, and I don't want to burn this food. But this is my daughter. This is the one I got her for her birthday. And these are real pages from the Harry Potter book. Look, even in the bottom, she decorates the bottom. Everything. She burns it like the edges to give it that rustic look. And that's my daughter's name and that's the quote i chose you could get them personalized i didn't get the Grinch one personalized but you can get them personalized i don't know if you could read with the other shine it says working hard is important but there is something more more there is something that matters more believing in yourself <clears throat> and this is her favorite house which is gryffindor she also likes slithering, slithering, I can't even say it. But you see how big and fat this one is compared to mine? Mine is just a skinny tall. And this one's like the thicker one. I kind of like, let me see. A little bit shorter, but a lot wider, if you see. You see, you could appreciate how big it is. So, I'm telling you, they are really good quality cups. And I love them. Even mine, mine she puts like the glitter it's like every like details all over and this one i'm gonna show you later this one like i said glows in the dark 
and this is not a pay punishment and whatsoever. I'm just giving her props for her good work. I got another five dollars. <laughs> Pay for her mother. Okay, guys, I'm in the dark here because um, I'm putting my cup to the light. If I could go in the bathroom and show you the glow in the dark part. I think it's ready. I'll just have it here for like a minute. The longer you let it sit, obviously, the better it will turn out. So let's go in the bathroom. Check, it's gonna be dark, but you'll see the cup. You see? Look how pretty. If I can make it darker, you'll we'll see it. And then the glitter. Oh my god, I'm in love, guys. Warm it up a little bit. Uh, Let me see. My hubby and I are gonna work on the gingerbread man. And the kids are working on the house. It's because he keeps stopping, that's why he adds more. Because <laughs> you don't know how to do it, sir. Oh, no. you saw me, right? No. Uncle, no, I didn't tell you. No, because you, you keep stopping. Because you're not pushing it hard enough. Look. This is the way you're doing Yeah, that's a lot. This is the way you're doing it. I saw. Oh, for a second, I thought you gave him. I'm gonna say, Mom, what the heck? Yeah, come on, I'll do it. Hey, don't come out either. That's a problem. I'm not sure Like, I think it's because I cut that hole too big. That's why. What hole? This hole. Because if it was smaller, I'd probably be able to do the design on the side. But when I try to squirt it out, it's not thick. So let me just try something oh. different. So this is my daughter's side of the roof. <laughs> and this is her side. Well, show my side. I did. And this is my son's roof. <laughs> and his side. <laughs> so this side came out better. But this roof came out better. So you got half a point each. So a point each. And then we did horribly with the gingerbread man. You try to turn him into an elf. <laughs> so we're gonna say good night. We'll see you to we'll see you on today's oh Saturday. Oh. We'll see you on Monday for another vlog. Monday. Good night. Uh, Bless week. Uh,